Hey YouTube, what's up? My name is Davin Duncanson. I'm a Jamaican-based photographer. I do video production and graphic designing as well. Today, I want to talk about the cost of photography gear in Jamaican dollars. And interestingly, did you know that an item that is sold in the US for, for say a dollar, we would have to buy for 120 Jamaican dollars, at least 120 Jamaican dollars. Interesting, isn't it? Hmm. I'll explain right after the intro. Hey guys, welcome back to the video. Thank you so much for stopping by. If it's your first time on this channel, please consider subscribing. Please leave a comment and also like the video. Today I'm going to be talking about, as I said earlier, the cost of photography equipment, mainly photography equipment in Jamaican dollars. So the cost of purchasing these equipment using Jamaican currency, all right? Today I'm also going to be using some of the very equipment that I personally own and use for my projects like weddings and so on. I'm going to be starting today with the, this is the Sony A7R2. This camera is currently being sold on Amazon for about $1,800 and in Jamaican currency, get this, in, Jama in the Jamaican currency, we would have to find $216,000 in Jamaican current dollars to buy this camera. All right, so next up we have the Canon 6D Mark II. It's a very nice camera for taking photos. And this camera is currently being sold on Amazon for $1,300, um, between $1,200 and $1,300. However, to purchase this camera using Jamaican currency, you would need $156,000. <laughs> yes, $156,000 just to get the camera body alone all right um next up i'm going to be talking about the lenses and i'm going to begin with the one of the lenses that i have for the canon camera now this is the sigma 35 millimeter 1.4 art lens for, and this is made for canon this lens is currently being sold for 650 dollars us and in to get this we would need to find 78,000 Jamaican dollars, all right? Um, next up, we have the Sony 24-70 F4. I, I use it, I, I love this lens. I use it for mainly for my video projects um, um, on my, you know, stabilizers. Um, this lens is currently being sold for $900 and we would need 108,000 Jamaican dollars to purchase this lens. All right, next up we have the, this, this bad boy here. This is the Sony 85 millimeter 1.8. Now this lens is currently being sold for 600 US dollars and to get this you would need 72,000 Jamaican dollars to purchase. All right, um, still got more, still got more. And now this, yes, this is the Sony 50 millimeter 1.4 Zeiss. There was some noise. Okay, it's gone. Please excuse the noise. I'm actually sitting on my, you know, back patio doing this video. All right. So this is the Sony 50 millimeter 1.4 Zeiss. This is a very good lens. Now this lens is currently being sold for. 1500 US dollars and to get this lens you would need 180,000 Jamaican dollars just to get this lens all right um, in addition to the cost of purchasing the lens you would have to pay different costs for example shipping and custom duty and so on and one of the main reasons that I wanted to do this video is really to show Jamaicans and other persons internationally the cost of photography in Jamaica all right Good photography, that's what I'm talking about. I mean, if, you, if you're trying to get the professional stuff, you know, the, the gear that will really make your work stand out, then that's the amount of money that you'll have to pay. Now, the reason why the figures appear, you know, <laughs> extremely large uh, for uh, to purchase the equipment using Jamaican dollars, it's mainly because of our exchange rate in Jamaica. 
you know the exchange rate for US dollars in Jamaica in Jamaica is about 120 it, it goes up to sometimes 130 or 40 um, dollars to one so one US dollar in Jamaica is worth a hundred and presently and about twenty five dollars there about all right so guys if you like this video please consider subscribing to my channel please leave a comment you know if i did a good job you know please let me know in, in the comment section below if, if i did not answer all your questions you can ask your questions down there as well i'll answer as many questions as possible and please come back for more until next time